So <clears throat> here uh, we have 9, um, 10, 11, and 12 is that deep one coming here. This muscle is the um, rectus capitis lateralis. And here's our here's C1, and here's our vertebral artery coming up. Um, and you can see, so 12, um, 11, 10, and 9. And 7 and 8 are up here. So 9 is going to come in and around going through the, um, the pars nervosa, coming out of the jugular foramen, and it's most um, anterior. And then on top of all of that, the... In the internal jugular vein is going to emerge um, extracranial and retrostyloid. And it's going to come up out on top. And But when it comes out on top, it's still deep to seventh nerve. And we can see that on the right side here. And um, seventh nerve comes out. The, the mastoid's been removed in this picture, but this is that same portion right here on the left and on the right that we're looking at. So here's seventh nerve in the fallopian canal, and it's coming out, and you can see here, this is just superficial to the internal jugular vein. So here's the sigmoid sinus coming down, jugular bulb coming out um, into the internal jugular vein, underneath seventh nerve, and on top of the rest that you can start to see over here, and then you can see a little bit more clearly in this image. Hey everyone, Ryan Rad here from neurosurgerytraining.org. If you like that video, subscribe and donate to keep our content available for medical students across the world.